we, we spent a lot of time, a um, hundred hours easily oh, on, oh, on the um, opening credits sequence. And um, we had a company called Digital Kitchen um, do it for us. And when they, when they started, they had an office in LA. By the, by the time we got really involved with them, really pregnant with them, they were only in Chicago. So everything was on um, getting sent back and forth by computer. Um, and we went through, the, we just in watching it again tonight, because I hadn't seen it for a while, I was remembering, we went through this thing frame by oh, frame God. about the, can we get the blood to drop a little closer to the drain in the sink? What it, whatever it was. Um, Shave, the shaving cut, all of that. And there was, there was lots of footage that we shot that, that we didn't use. To speak to the music, the uh, main title theme, as opposed to the, the composer for, the, for each episode, the main title theme was composed by Rolf Kent, um, who we were just really very lucky to get. We had him for two days before he went off to Burning Man. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> and he, he did, um, for those of you who don't know him, he did Election and Matador. Um, Very talented. Just wonderful, wonderful mm -hmm. British um, guy. And, and, and he sat with us for about an hour. We talked about kind of what we wanted and how we wanted it to be sort of contrapuntal to, um, to what the show was about. And, and to, as, as Sarah would say, I want, to, I want a, a theme that if I'm in the other room and I hear that, I know it's Dexter and I'm going to come back to the television. And he turned in his, you know, this, his first draft of, of the music, and it was about 90% there. Yeah. We gave him a couple of notes on the telephone. He uh, went, sat at his computer. He, he made the changes and sent them to us. I must say that through the body of the show, we have other music um, that's by a composer named Daniel Licht, who um, has just been a gold mine for us. He's really found the, the voice, voice of the show, the musical right. voice of the show. So we always want to be, the, have the music be contrapuntal. If, it's, if, if the, the action on screen is scary, not necessarily to underscore it with music that says, oh, this is scary. It's always to sort of throw you a little bit off so that you're looking at things in a new way.